Hello guys, this is Tony here and today I wanted to show you how to create discount module in Xcard 5. Um, this video guide will be based on the article in our knowledge base which can be found at uh, kb.xcard.com If you go there and type creating discount in the search field you will easily find this article there. Okay, let's get started. First off, you need to understand that each global discount in Xcard 5 is an order modifier. Order modifier is a routine that applied to order subtotal in order to calculate some surcharges which will be added to the order subtotal and eventually we will get an order total. For instance, shipping cost or taxes are order modifiers too. Let's start with the model itself. I'm going to create an empty module as a first step and uh, my developer ID will be Tony and module ID will be discount demo. I'm going to create a module by a macro so I'm going to my console and calling next SDK dev kit macros create module module equal Tony discount demo. Now I'm checking that my main PHP file is created. So I go to the classes X light module Tony discount demo main PHP file and as you can see it's created so it's time to uh, enable this module and first we have to redeploy the store in order to allow Xcard installation to see this newly created non-activated module so I'm initiating redeployment of the store Now my X card can see discount module and I can enable it. So saving changes and the module is enabled. Now it's time to create our global discount class that will be used in card calculation. The template of global discount class is stored in the classes X light logic order modifier discount class the entire folder xlight logic order modifier contains different kinds of order modifier templates for instance template for shipping class or abstract class for taxes let's create our own discount class in the module so we go to the folder classes X slide module Tony discount demo and create folder logic order modifier. Inside this folder, we create file called discount PHP. Now we specify namespace, which repeats path to the folder. X light module tiny discount demo logic order modifier. Class name is discount as it repeats the file name, extends X light logic order modifier discount the next step is we have to specify two properties of this class is protected type and protected code protected type defines the type of surcharge in our 
case it's x light modal base surcharge type discount code property defines the line in the card information where info about the surcharge will be displayed for instance shipping cost will be displayed in the shipping line our discount value must be aggregated in the total discount line so we specify code as discount finally we have to specify calculate method of this discount class which will be run during card calculation I'll show you where exactly it will be called we go to the classes x slide model order PHP file and search for calculate we can find public function calculate there is for each these get modifiers which will fetch all order modifiers including our discount and if modifier returns can apply as true in our case it's not specified but it returns true by default then calculate method will be run now we go back to our discount class and specify this calculate method it's public and it must return surcharge object or or null first of all we calculate discount amount by taking order subtotal and multiplying by 0.1 then we apply this discount amount to the order first parameter is code this is value for it and our discount the result of add order surcharge method will be surcharge object so we save the result to surcharge variable also we want to distribute discount amount across all card items that's why i'm going to call this distribute discount method with single parameter discount now our discount class is ready and we want to let xcard know that it must be used during card calculation that's why we are creating install yaml file we go to the classes x slide module tony discount demo folder and create new file called install yaml the content of our install yaml file will tell xcard that x slide modal order modifier must contain one more record class name of the class will be namespace plus class name discount and weight will define order in which order modifiers will be applied to a card 
Okay, now our install YAML file is ready and we need to push it to the database. I'm going to do it by a macro. Next uh, SDK, pipkit, macros, load YAML, and then path to our YAML file. Now our install YAML push to the database and we have to redeploy the store in order to see our model in action. Now the store is redeployed and we go to the customer area in order to see our module in action. We add a product to a cart and then view cart. As you can see, there is a line called discount with 10% discount there. Of course, usually you want to create more complex discount modules. And in this case, you will have to have more complex calculate method, as well as you want to extend method can apply and define complex condition there in order to tell Xcard whether this discount must be applied or not. Thank you guys for watching this video and if you have any questions or comments, please send us a message at developers at xcard.com. Thank you, bye.